I'm going to talk to you today about a subject that many of my colleagues in design, but also in product design in architecture, actually think is boring. Many of them think it's old fashioned. Some of them think it's even politically questionable. Some others think it's only commercial. And the subject, of course, as you've heard already in the introduction, is beauty. And I'm trying, I'll try in the next 35, 40 minutes or so to convince you that that sort of thinking is not only old fashioned, but it's actually also rather stupid. I'd say that. I, I try to explain to you why this subject of beauty is truly important, that it's really part of who we are as humans. And I'll talk about why this sentence, beauty is in the eye of the beholder, is probably the single worst thing that ever happened to beauty. It was, it came out of a novel, of a romantic novel from the 19th century. and. It is actually not true because so there is a surprising agreement around the world throughout every culture and throughout time of what we think is beautiful and what is not. Then of course, most difficulty is to create beauty because to create something that functions is actually very easy. I suspect that so many specifically within graphic design, so many people call themselves problem solvers because the problems that we solve are so easy to do. But to solve a problem beautifully is much more difficult. Of course, you still have to solve the problem, otherwise it's not design. It has to work, of course. But to solve it in a way that a viewer or a user would actually find joy in it is very difficult. That's a completely different issue. And I think so many of us don't want to go there because it becomes so much more difficult. I'll just show you an example here. Another designer that I know who actually used to work for us. He was an intern in our studio. This is the many, many iterations he went through before he finally settled on the poster for a sports design exhibition in his hometown in Zurich. This is real work. This is this was difficult. He worked, you know, many weeks on creating this poster and he just didn't give up here. You see the final uh, the final iteration of it. 